I think we have another legit sneaker of the year contender. What is up guys? Once again, it's your boy Derek, also known as the chosen one on Instagram with another fresh unboxing and review video from my good friends over at Sneaker Freaker by way of the kickstand and it's more than just sneaker lifestyle tool. Like I said before, these bad boys have the potential to be sneaker of the year. Now before we get right into the kicks, I just got a few things to say about the box. Now usually we have come to expect stunningly designed boxes from the Sneaker Freaker crew. Now for this release, we just have a regular brown box, straightforwardly adorned with the ASICS logo, Atmos logo, and the Sneaker Freaker logo. To me, this is a pretty unusual direction Sneaker Freaker took considering their last Gel Light 3 collaboration produced one of the best printed design boxes that year. Also, the last Melbourne-based ASICS collaboration, the Update Store GT2, produced one of the best design boxes this year. Now, we're not talking about boxes, we're talking about kicks. Today we have the first triple collaboration between Australia-based sneaker publication Sneaker Freaker, Japan-based boutique Atmos, and ASICS Sports Style. Ladies and gents, today we have the ASICS Gel Light 3 in sheet rock and gentry purple, nicknamed the Alley Cats. And without further ado, ladies and gents, these are the ASICS Gel Light 3 Alley Cats. Let's get right into the specs and oh boy, is there a lot to unpack. Starting us off with this gray and purple lilac suede found on the toe box, heel, side panels, and I stay. You just know the sweet is legit if it changes shade once you run your fingers right through them. The black OG style of these nettings on the side panel returns in between the tiger stripes and the heel. The luscious regal satin split tongue will have two different stitch branding logos. The right pair will feature the sneaker freaker logo and the left pair will have the Atmos Tokyo logo. Meanwhile, the inner liner is made out of a soft black cotton fabric. Moving on to the heel, a silver gray pull tab can be found here with the Alley Cat logo in 3M. The embossed Sneaker Freaker logo can be found on the right pair, while a debossed Atmos logo can be found on the left pair. Each side of the heel panel will feature a Debo's classic A6 Gel Light 3 logo. Here we'll also find a great TPU based heel cup that provides stability and lockdown. Now for me personally, there are three main highlights of the uppers. The really cool and nicely detailed aluminum eyelets, the glow in the dark double panels found in the toe box and the Tiger Stripes logo. But my favorite element of them all is this hairy cowhide leather used as a side panel. I've never seen it yet used in another Gel Light 3 model. To me, it already adds another level of premiumness to an already great sneaker. Out of the box, it will come equipped with a slime colored black dotted lace. And yes, for you lace lovers, there is an extra pair of purple black dotted Laces. Both set of laces will be featuring the Sneaker Freaker and Atmos logos at their lace tips. Pretty dope! Much of the cushioning will be provided by the Tri-Density EVA base midsoles, the gel packet found at the heel, and the neoprene base insoles. Which, by the way, check out the dull printing on these bad boys. And for you guys asking, nope. Speckles of stripes and the logos don't glow in the dark, but they do still look hella cool. The midsoles is broken up by a purple rubber mid panel with white paint speckles. Meanwhile, traction is provided by the rubber outsole with flex grooves. The A6 logo can be found in the middle part of the slime colored soles. I really wish the collaborators extended the glow-in-the-dark capabilities to the speckles on the midsole and the screen slime-colored part of the soles. I mean, more glow-in-the-dark bits, the merrier, right? And now for some fun facts. Sneaker Freaker and Atmos over the years have had numerous successful collaborations with ASICS. But this is the first time the three iconic brands come together to give us this amazing sneaker which is inspired by the nightlife culture in the alleyways of Melbourne 
and Tokyo. Fun fact number two. Me and a ton of A6 Jedi 3 fans have been clamoring for years for A6 to return the original shape of the Jedi 3. A6, Sneaker Freaker, and Atmos has delivered that in the silhouette and more. Thank you so so much A6 for bringing back the heritage shape adding a few more heritage details in this release. And lastly, fun fact number three, the sneaker is a tribute to the entertainment nightlife subculture that packs the laneways of Melbourne and Tokyo, hence the name Alley Cats. As a sneaker collector from Melbourne, there are tons of things I really love about this release. The impeccable attention to detail in use of premium materials coupled with the traditional purple and gray sneaker freaker color blocking sprinkled in with some hits of green makes this a home run release but it's also the rich storytelling the return of the og shape oh and did i just forget to mention the glow in the dark capabilities makes the sneaker a certified top three release of 2022. Now I know this may sound like a hometown decision, but the sneaker is definitively as of this moment, a top three release for me with a chance to go much higher. I give this release a solid 10 out of 10. Now these bad boys run true to size narrow, wide footers may want to go half a size up. And although they have sold out pretty much everywhere, they're still fairly reasonably priced in the wild. They range from 250 to 350 Australian. Thanks again guys for watching and supporting my channel on Feet Shots are now available in my chosen one Instagram account. Links will be provided down below. Hit that like and subscribe button guys if you have found value in this video. I would greatly appreciate it. Till the next unboxing and review, goodbye, take care, and stay safe.